afternoon, good evening to you. Today, today we're going to Sukna. Sukna is like the nearest kind of like beach area near Cairo. Um, there is a power cut this morning. I don't know why. Like the first time, yeah, there's a power cut. So I'm using the gas stove to make tea. But yeah, um, <clears throat> I was gonna watch TV. I was gonna make tea and watch TV, but I can't do that clearly. So, and I wanna make some hot food, but I can't do that clearly unless I use a gas stove. And I want to charge my phone. And I can't. And I need to charge you. I need to charge you. And I can't. So, yeah. It's kind of sucky. I don't know if the electricity will come back on before we leave. Hopefully it will. But I don't know why Egypt has power cuts so often. Um, I just know that it happens regularly. Out in Taiwan for a year. And in Taiwan, like every area in the capital city gets a power cut every month. And it's to help save the government um, more money and um, it's because the government wants to save more electricity and it just helps people to use less electricity and um, which I think is a really good idea I think it's really good I think like the British government for example they spend so much money on advertisements telling us to like use less electricity use less electricity charge your phone less use your car less um, don't waste, use solar power, and no one ever like does anything, so it's just like a waste of money. So I think the government in Britain should also learn from Taiwan and Egypt and just make every area have a power cut every month, because it will save the government millions of pounds every year, and it will teach us a lesson, and I think British people need to, <laughs> need to be taught a lesson about not wasting. Cinnamon tea. Cinnamon. So we are on our way to Zika. We are on our way to Zika. And we're gonna go to Sukna, which is a place near the sea so we can swim. I think I have everything. I mean, it's only, we're only there for three days. But like I said, I'm a very light traveler, so packing is not really a big deal for me. It takes me like 15, 20, half an hour, an hour. I don't have the keys. What? I have to take out this thing so I want to go to the toilet. Oh, that's so cute. You need a toilet. Poor boy's been waiting here with no keys. I need the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Go up. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go up. Take care of the thing. Ah, boys, 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 boys. driving for like two hours, two and a half hours, three hours. They're doing like check-in stuff. So oh, he's gonna teach me the proper way to do it. I think I was doing it fine. I was doing it fine. Oh, right. You did the other way. Let me show you. This is hard to do with one hand. Hot, 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 hot.
and Shiru will be sharing one room and then my cousin and his parents and my auntie and uncle will be in another room which is next door so ah oh, it's so nice to finally be here Um, Shiru has gone to like the swimming pool with my cousin. My auntie and uncle are next door on the balcony having tea and chatting. The reason I'm not going out is because um, I've got a little bit of, well, firstly, I'm tired. Like, my cousins, they came home and they just wanted to like immediately change and go, which they did. They came in, immediately changed into their swimsuits and went to the pool. And then I was like, seriously? Like, are we not even gonna rest first? Cause I'm pretty tired. Like, I kinda wanna have a cup of tea and just sit on a balcony and chill. Um, which makes me sound so old. I know, I know, I know. But you know, that was what I wanna do. And then they were like, oh, you're so boring. So they left without me. Um, but anyway, yeah, I'm a little bit tired. And also I'm on my period, so my stomach feels bloated and it looks a little bloated. And I don't want to wear a bikini when I'm looking like this. Like this, you know? So, um, yeah. So I'm gonna make myself some tea and we're gonna have tea together, yay! In our beautiful hotel beach resort's room. And we are gonna chill, you and me. You know, if my cousins wanna go to the pool without me, that is fine, because I have you. So, let's see how, look how pretty our bathroom is. Yay. Yay. Ba -ba -ba -ba. They do, we arrived yesterday. I'll say day one. This is day one of us at Sukna Beach. Um, and this beach resort like is really it's really quiet. Um, there's like no one here. I don't know if it's because it's February or if it's because it's a bad hotel. But yeah, there's like only a few families here out of the whole thing. But it's kind of nice because like having it's almost like we have our own private pool, like we have our own private like gym, we have our own private sauna almost. Cause we, it's like we have the whole hotel to ourselves. Oh man. Uh, it's now like half one, one thirty. We are going to the beach. And so this morning after breakfast, we all went to the gym. After the gym, we went to the indoor heated pool. After the indoor heated pool, we went to um, like a mini water park. We have like a mini water park in the resort. After that, we rested and now we're going to the beach. Yay! Oh, I'm so excited to go to the beach. The last time I went to the beach, I have no idea when the last time I went to the beach was. I think it was June when I went to France, south of France for a few days. Um, but the beach is nice, like, there was no sand, there was all pebbles and stones, and you couldn't really play around, apart from some bath and swim. So, yeah. Oh, we're here, we're here. Walking, 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 listening music, walking forever to the roads of nowhere, walking, walking until we're hungry, walking. Welcome to day two 
of Sukhna. And we're actually leaving today, like we're actually on our way back to Cairo. So we came on Saturday, stayed Sunday, and now it's Monday and we're leaving. So yeah. It was a short, sweet weekend. A very short, very sweet weekend. And now we're leaving back to Cairo. It's like a two hour drive. So that'll be fun. Oh my gosh. So, like along the highway um, of this area, there's like loads of people selling fish, like fresh fish. So we just stopped at one of the places to get like fresh seafood to take home. But um, yeah, look at this place. It's like pretty much deserted. We're back and it's time for dinner. It's like five. <laughs> the Egyptian foods. Chinese foods. Chinese foods. Egyptian foods. Chinese foods. Egyptian foods. Egyptian and Chinese. Egyptian. 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 We have another power cut. Scary. <laughs> 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 